What's up and welcome back to another video. I'm Bandit Barney bringing you everything you need to know about Red Dead Online. And over the weekend or so, we did a video about the things that you should not do that are generally accepted as either money making methods, quick tips or whatever in the game. I think we had four total. Today, we're doing something a little bit different because I have a feeling regarding these money making methods that just it's a little bit off but because the way the game set up and with all these different lobbies and uh, lobbies interacting different than each other for example one lobby can have a gang hideout in this location another lobby in that same location won't have a gang hideout so I, I, I wanted to bring this to you guys and kind of see where you're at because it was maybe two or three weeks ago where I found the best money making method in the game to date which was fishing sturgeon uh, right next to the butcher in Blackwater. Essentially, you could catch upwards of 10, 12 sturgeon every 15 minutes. When you did this uh, method, most effectively, you could get 70 plus dollars every 10 minutes, which was the fastest way of fishing, farming, money making that I knew of in the game. Nothing else even came close. It doesn't work anymore though. At least I've tried it a few times, not a few times, I've probably tried it seven times since then. And when I say tried it, I don't mean I've just gone to Blackwater, threw my line in, didn't see a sturgeon and gave up. I've gone to that lo same location seven times and each time I go there, the max I can get is two sturgeon every 10 minutes. I just don't get them spawning as often. Now I've tried where I f load in a free lo roam lobby in Blackwater, so there's players there. Uh, the more often though, I tried the method where I load into a lobby away from where I wanna be, which in this case, Blackwater, so I'll load in to Lemoyne, and then fast travel to Blackwater. I found more success in farming methods by doing this region loading uh, thing, and it's the same. We're only getting two sturgeon every 10 minutes. That is at least my experience with that method. Now, there's other areas of the game where things have changed and Rockstar hasn't said much. So is Rockstar hot fixing certain money making methods? One of the big things they did originally was they took out the cougar method that was near Blackwater and, and they just really got rid of that cougar spawn. That was something that I think maybe even worked better than Sturgeon. I don't know. I didn't jump on that train. I just know that it was taken away as soon as it was found out that it was so good. Now, going in and I've gone, when this idea came to me that, hey, I'm not getting Sturgeon the way I used to be. I was making like 70 bucks a minute and now I'm down to like 15 if I'm only catching the Sturgeon and 20 if I'm catching the other fish while I'm waiting for them to spawn back in drastically different money making there it's fifty dollars difference there so i went and i tried some other methods and i want you guys this is i want this to be a conversation with you guys so we can kind of figure out where we're at right now and if rockstar is hot fixing these and just for you guys that don't know what a hot fix is it's basically a server side change that the developer will put in and it's an immediate change there's no download for it and it'll be a server side change to the game so i haven't seen a single download or patch that would lead me to believe that these things are being changed it's a hot fix that i think has happened here and i've gone to other methods as well we checked the cougars in uh tumbleweed around there there's also a cougar that can spawn up by strawberry because i wanted to see how effective these methods would work now some of the methods that i tried were newer methods we went on uh, youtube and did a search for like the last 24 hours upload video and if we found a money making method that we hadn't tried before went in and tried that out they're not working so well they're just not working as well as they're either uh played out to work or as well as it, it would be worth the money making method uh it'd be worth farming this area now the cougar uh the cougars i've tried hunting and basically in these areas i would go in there i would do the region spawn and i'd do that like three or four times for per area that i wanted to test out because if you go to this money farming area and you can't get a cougar after three loads of the game then it probably won't make sense to use that as a money farm it just isn't going to be as efficient now 
one of my underlying opinions here now this is just my opinion I know that if I say something brash you guys are in the comments down below completely disagree some of you will um, and that will inevitably happen but it, it is of my opinion here that maybe Rockstar is hot fixing some of these money making methods like the sturgeon in Blackwater or the cougar because not only to make it more balanced but to push the showdown series push the series where you're more interactive with other players we did a video where i talked about how the three things that you want in game xp money and gold all those methods individually are done best by yourself now the showdown series is great because you earn all three at the same time and there really isn't a comparison to getting all three done like the showdown series but on top of that it's more interactive it, when you go to play a showdown series you're not playing with the NPC you're playing against other players and we've said on this channel before massive online multiplayer games really really thrive on getting that player to player interaction so as Rockstar kind of pushing us a little bit to hey you, you were doing this you were fishing over here um, and it's kind of a monotonous activity it to me is a little bit boring it may not be to you when you're there for an hour or so uh, fish farming or hunting it gets a little bit repetitive to me maybe rockstar is pushing us a little bit away from those with hot fixes into showdown series and player to player interaction now is it just balance is the other side is it just balancing out the ideas or even is it real are, is, are they actually hot fixing some of these areas we know that they changed the cougar spawn let me know what you guys think about the blackwater sturgeon because that was the best money making method in the game that i knew of and 70 bucks every 10 minutes it just you can't really compete with that and it, are you guys having the same experience where now that method is not producing as many sturgeon there are some areas like van horn where you can still get tons of pike and uh i think it's sturgeon up there or maybe it's musky you can get tons of those but there's no butcher up there so it's not really a commonly used tactic or method and so there's no hot fix you can still get tons of those big fish there but are, is Rockstar hot fixing these things to push us into the PvP area? Now, we are in 2019 and we're going to be seeing some more content. So, we can expect this month to probably see heists or wagon. There, this month, we will probably see a new big money making method. Now, it, I think that that will come in the form of like robberies and heists. But regardless of, of uh, that, the next big money making method I would assume from Rockstar is going to be more player to player interactive because activities that are done by yourself that are best completed by yourself don't promote that long lasting interaction between players in games that are that make them so popular. I did want to make this a conversation because the lobbies are so skewed at times like you can go in an area that generally will yield you a bunch of fish you go to a different lobby set up the same way and it just doesn't work as well it works at like 50 or 60 percent so they can be skewed and i could spend hours and hours and hours testing them all out but i i have this platform uh luckily that you guys are here so I want to know where you're at on this and if you've noticed any changes to some of the money farming methods you do a lot of experienced players in the game really um, to, to, to my knowledge really promote the showdown series as being the best way to level up gain money and get gold and it's becoming harder and harder to dispute this and this might be by design on Rockstar's end I'm not great with a controller, so initially I was apprehensive to the Showdown series because I was just getting wrecked by console players. Um, I jumped on console because right now Red Dead 2 is only on console. As soon as it comes to PC, I'll jump back over. Besides that, the console players with more experience have made it harder for me to win in Showdown. As being a competitive player, I don't really like doing things that I'm not good at can hurt sometimes because you're generally not good at something the first time you do it. I am, however, leaning more towards the Showdown series is becoming more and more the best way to level up, gain money, and get gold all at the same time. 
on top of letting me know how you have seen or if you have seen changes in the recent uh, or in your money making or XP farming methods. Actually, you know what? I don't think XP farming has changed at all, but money making seems to be changing a little bit. Let me know of some of the other methods that you have for money farming because I'm looking to test out all these different methods and see where Rockstar is going with this game and i hope that they are going in the direction of you know player to player interaction being the best way to earn money xp and gold right now the showdown series is kind of split there's the the group of people that have played it and practiced and are very good at it and uh it works very very well and then there's the group of people who have been hunting and farming and fishing like me and um we don't end up getting all those like playing against other experienced players where the showdown series can be kind of painful so let me know down below if you think rockstar is pushing hot fixes out i don't think that it's it, it's like a, a land blast where they're hot fixing all these different methods but it does seem that the sturgeon got hot fixed and when, when we read more into it it looks like it's something to push players to be more interactive with each other which isn't necessarily a bad thing guys thank you so much for your support on the channel we're gonna keep coming hard took a little break to go back with the family during christmas but we're back in the office and getting things done so we're gonna give you everything red dead online in the coming future if you want to stick around for that make sure you're subscri subscribed 2019 is going to be a great year i hope you're sticking with your resolutions and you haven't broken them already but for this game specifically, 2019 is going to be amazing, and I look forward to seeing where it goes and where we go as a community. Thank you so much for your support. We really, really appreciate it. And until the next video, take care.